I'm 19 Keys, and this is High Level Conversation. The library. The library. So there's the Wall Street Trapper Empire, mm-hmm. right? We here in your studio. Yeah, man, it's the trap. Wall Street looks like us now show. Yeah. Right? It comes on every single Tuesday. Yeah. Something you decided to do independently, self-funded, start organically, start from the ground up, giving the game out, right? And at the same time, then you decided to, okay, I'm not only going to teach you the stock game, I'm going to teach you the option game. Mm-hmm. You got into the option game, trailblazing. You got into the option game on fire. <laughs> I'm not starting light. We're going to start heavy. And I'm yeah. telling everybody I'm getting in so that they can make a way because either way, I'm going to make some moves. Yeah. So you come in the option game and you start killing it. You know what I'm saying? You have some losses, but you have way more wins. Mm-hmm. Right? And then you decided to go transparent. I'm going to show everybody what I'm doing. Yeah. Right? So ain't nothing fake about this. Yeah. Right? The market, three sessions, up, down. What's my separator? Transparency. Yeah. You get to see. You ain't got to guess. You know what it is. So everything is accounted for. Yeah. Right? Then you created a community with the Patreon so that those that want to connect with it, right, and actually want to follow along outside of the Trapper University that mm-hmm. you have where you're already teaching, See, what I'm looking at is one skill set that built out this whole empire. What was it? Right? Started off with just this one single knowledge of understanding the market. Yep. And then you was able to build all of these instruments. Then you was able to go on tour, right? Went on tour. time I was doing my tour, while she trapped outside with it. Yeah. In the streets with yeah. the people. First of all, I want to get into some of your creative entrepreneurship. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Damn. Hey, when you say it like that, I'm like, damn, we can't do that. Damn. It's it's a it's an empire. It's a I don't think people really appreciate the gravity of the gangster that is required to think outside the box. And yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? The the looking at the social media, oh, he did this. That ain't even the magic. Nah. The magic is the behind the scenes talking to the team. The magic is putting together the plan. Yeah. The magic is deciding what the magic is. Yeah, that people feel this magic. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. it's the Man, I got to get it out the mud. I got to be the separator. I got to execute better than everybody else. I got to isolate, incubate, and execute. Yeah, you know man. what I'm talking about? So, like, what's the, what's the Wall Street trap away? How the hell you get to be so creative in your execution to build all these products out? Why you ain't just stop at trading stocks for yourself and being happy? Um, I think, you know, I told you earlier that when, uh, when, the, when you have an assignment, you get chastised more when you veer from it or breach it. Mm-hmm. Um, I know this game changed my life. I don't care what somebody who just found me today or tomorrow got to say. This game changed my life. And I know how many people that come from where I come from that have no value on themselves. I'm going to say something I said in the first interview that feel like they buried, but they really planted. Mm but they don't have nobody to fertilize them. Mm. This game fertilized me. This game gave me new life. And you, I, I, was, I remember me and this dude used to run together. His name was Pocky. And he had got a thing called Hood Estates. And I remember he, uh, he started bringing, when I started hanging with him, he used to rent these houses in Orlando all the time. And he used to rent these houses in Fort Lauderdale. And then one day he told me, one day this is going to become normal to you. So you're going to have to affect, you're going to have to introduce other people to it to find joy. Because if not, you'll get bored with it. Mm. He was talking about the houses that happened to me with the market. Mm. I was doing what I was doing, but it was just me. Because people, People were so hesitant about it. But I just kept going. And then you start to see one person say, Trap, you changed my life. And then you see another person say, Trap, I quit my job. And you hear another person say, Trap, I made $4,000. Trap, I gave up the streets. Trap, I stopped stripping. Trap. And you see these people say this and you can't help but let the human part of you start to bleed out. And I was like, that's when I got the tattoos. And, and I was just, I'm like, yo, everything in me has to become this. Mm. 
And if I do it at a high level, I don't got to worry about what compete with nobody because it's going to be a lane by myself. It's going to be me. And so going outside, doing a tour, you know, going do six, seven days in the cities and just going in the parks and do it, I felt at home. I remember us being in Baltimore and the dudes in Baltimore said, Trap, you don't even need no security, dog. We got you. You mm. solid out here, dog. Yeah. We respect a real one out here. And I was like, yeah, that's that's the that's what coming from behind the computer. Everybody ain't gonna get that. Mm-hmm. And we went in every from LA to Houston to we was in the hoods, bro. And every hood gave us the same embrace. And that and that right there, bro, that's what I right, we can't stop. And so now for me, it was how do we just keep creating ways to go touch people? How do we keep creating ways to be a financial juggernaut? Not even much trying to compete with uh, with no other podcast or nothing, but to say, all right, CNBC, that's who y'all talking to. We don't got to talk to them. We're going to talk to them. And guess what? It's more broke people in the world. It's more poor people in the world. It's more working poor people in the world than the 1%. So I ain't worrying about your platform, but trust me, y'all going to hear about me. Mm. Because the meek shall inherit the earth. Mm. The head, the tail shall become the head. Mm. The financial slave will become the financial mm. master. And that's us, man. It's just our time to rejoice. It's time for us to be jubilant. It's time for us to be financially rejuvenated. And so that's where I find my power at. Right? My charge up, you know, I don't got nothing. I, I don't got to show off a lot of lifestyle stuff because that ain't really me. My real passion is seeing somebody say, Trap, I made $10,000. Trap, we made $88,000. Trap, from January to now, you pro- I ain't made what you made, but I made $100,000, bro. Like, I'm like, you know, you know what I'm saying? So for me, if I can keep, sh- that's why it was easy for me to be transparent. It's easy to be transparent when you ain't trying to hide nothing. It's easy to be transparent when you really want to show people that it's possible. You know, I don't got to, no, I didn't start with, when I started the options account on the show, I didn't. I started with three hundred thousand dollars, four hundred thousand dollars, but shit, and two, we don't turn it to two point five million, right? But guess what else you can see? My percentages. We average hundred percent per trade. Out of twenty six trades together, we only lost on three trades. Mm. And my people up the same percentages: four hundred percent, five hundred percent, three hundred percent, two hundred percent, one hundred percent. No matter if you got one contract or you got ten contracts, you up that. Man, that's power. Because once a person who has accepted poverty gets a taste of wealth, they can't go back to that. Mm. It's like taking the, taking the field slave and showing that he ain't got to go be a house nigga. He could be a master. Mm. That's a different type of power. And you ain't got to ask the master to let you free because you went and took it. Mm-hmm. So we in a financial revolt right now. The financial revolution. We the financial revolutionaries. We need high level conversations. We need a Wall Street trap. We need people that's going to be authentic and real to the people and talk to them in a way they can be talked to, but also raise their consciousness. Mm -hmm. It's needed right now, man. So that's, man, that's what keep me going, man. That's that's. I ain't never going to stop, bro. I told my team, like, if you ain't going to be with me for 20 years, walk out the door right now. Mm. We got 20 years in us. Well, I know you gotta go. Yeah, man. And Get my baby girl. Man. I want to thank you for your time. If man, I have thank more you, time, I'll ask you about your state of being and how you're taking care of yourself physically yeah, and man. all of that as we talk about yeah. outside of this. Yeah. But, yeah. You know, fatherhood is the yeah. duty. Ah, I love you, brother. Yes, yeah, sir. Love you, I brother. appreciate you, thank you brother. Once I appreciate again. you, man. Y'all, welcome to the trap every Tuesday, 7 p.m. Eastern time on the Wall Street. Look like us on network. Man, come over there. Let us know you're a high leveler. We're going to shout you out. We live, man. Bless up. Bless you, man. Next time on High Level Conversation. Yes, sir. Nineteen keys. This is High Level Conversation. Goddamn with the dog. Number one, this is a great time for me because all the shit that I talk about, it's a booming right now. Yeah. <laughs> I get to take off my old videos. I get. Shit, I told y'all. Yeah. I told y'all, I y'all ain't listen. T- <laughs> <laughs> ain't nothing like I good. I told y'all. Ain't nothing like that. I told you so, buddy. <laughs> I told you. Ain't nothing like a good. I told God you. So. Damn. I told y'all that. 
Peace family, this is 19 Keys, this is 19 Minutes. When you focus on creating, the experience that you have of making money is going to be automatically dialed into that. Not in excuses, because I don't live with excuses. I live with decisions. We're so fixated on the attention and not where the value actually is. That the success is not in completion. The success is in the execution. When I saw that, it turned me up to another level as far as what I'm able to know that I can accomplish. If they take my deal away right now, I know I'll find another way to get money. Yeah. Cause it's just the hustler in me, but. I feel like I'm always in that mode, bro. No matter what I'm doing, I'm taking something in. This doesn't mean we have to agree. It doesn't mean any of that, but we're sharing the truth. That it's not your responsibility to stop triggering people. It's their responsibility to heal. My ancestral part is you do for your people. They can understand rare human beings that build out all of their complexity and live around their gifts, skills, and talents. Peace family, 19 Keys tapping in. I just shot a high level conversation right here inside this beautiful black owned business called Napoli Naturals Apothec. Now this business has everything that you need for your wellness needs and it's right here in the historic landmark area of Lamarck Park. The thing is, we want to be able to do partnerships and collaborations, sponsorships with all of the different types of businesses that need that advertising that people may not know exist like this beautiful gym right here in the background. So make sure y'all tap in. If you want us to come pull up and you want us to shoot at your shop, make sure you go to 19keys.com or click the link below, right? And sign up so we can tap in and have you on high level. Because the more people that know you exist, the more people that can tap into your services. Peace, fam. I'm 19 Keys and this is a high level conversation. The library. The library.